Hey guys, welcome back to another tutorial. Doing something slightly different today, I'm going to be stamping over Empower Nail Art. Now if you're not familiar with it, it is an ultra thin, flexible self-adhesive film which can be used on bare nails or over gel polish or you can encase in acrylic or hard gel. So if you're interested, then just stay tuned. So first up, I'm going to do a really quick demo of a full nail wrap using Empower Nail Art and then I'm going to stamp over the top. I will put a link down below to the Empower Nail Art YouTube channel because it does give you full instructions on how to do this and obviously making sure your nail is fully prepped and cleansed and dry before you place the full nail wrap on but as you can see the actual material is really thin and flexible and you can really stretch it to get a nice smooth finish so once you have your application all smoothed out you can get rid of the ends by using a crystal file and using a downward motion just to get the end off any other file will make really sort of nasty frills on the end, so a crystal file is definitely best for this. So because I smoothed out the film with my thumb, I need to remove any finger oils with 99% IPA. And then onto the stamping, I'm just using a black stamping polish and then a floral stamping plate and a marshmallow squishy stamper and a credit card style scraper. So here is the finished design and I have a double top coated with the CND Shellac Express 5 top coat. So all I need to do now is remove the tacky layer and that is it and it looks really really lovely with the black and you can really see the silver hollow sort of peeping through the petals etc. And I'm just going to turn my light off because you can probably see it better without the light shining on it, you can see the definition of the stamping on there. So I have another couple of quick examples to show you. This is two coats of CND Shellac in pink bikini and I've removed the inhibition layer. And then I'm going to take the silver hollow uh, film and some curvy scissors. I'm just going to cut the corner off. Then I'm going to peel it away from the backing and as you can see it's really really thin and I'm going to stick this on diagonally and smooth it down and then take off any excess with the crystal file. And again, because I've been touching it with my thumb, I'm just going to remove the oils with IPA. And then I'm going to use this really cute um, skull design, because I know Lucian loves skulls. Um, and then stamp it on, and it gives this really cool two-tone effect. So a quick final demo, I've got two coats of shellac in Creekside with the tacky layer removed again and then I've cut a curvy strip using those scissors and the rainbow film this time. And then I'm just going to peel that away from the backing and apply it vertically down the nail. Thank you. 
and then I'm just going to stamp a really cute floral design in white. So these are the designs all finished and top coated. So I hope I've given you some inspiration into combining Empower Nail Art and stamping. So really hope you enjoyed this one guys and subscribe to see more and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!